What's up, tech enthusiasts and global affairs aficionados? Revo now back at it again, diving deep into a topic that's reshaping the future of warfare. Today, we're exploring the game-changing advancements in military technology coming out of Turkey and China, specifically their next-gen combat drones and military robots. Hold on tight, because we're about to explore a reality where the battlefields of tomorrow might look more like a sci-fi film than ever before. Imagine a chessboard, but instead of traditional pieces, we have swarms of intelligent drones controlled by sophisticated AI. Turkey and China are already making significant strides in this field, and the implications are massive. Get ready to have your minds blown as we delve into the details of these technological leaps and analyze what they mean for the future of global security. The world has already witnessed the impact of drone technology in recent conflicts. From targeted strikes to surveillance and reconnaissance, drones have become indispensable assets in modern warfare. Turkey and China are pioneering a new era of drone warfare, characterized by autonomy, lethality, and unprecedented scale. Turkey's Bayraktar TB2 drone has proven its effectiveness in conflicts in Syria, Libya, and Nagorno-Karabakh. Both Turkey and China are heavily investing in research and development, pushing the boundaries of what these unmanned systems can achieve. This is the future that Turkey and China are building towards, and it's a future that has the potential to reshape the geopolitical landscape. China, with its immense technological prowess and resources, is also making significant strides in military robotics. From unmanned ground vehicles designed for combat to sophisticated AI-powered systems capable of analyzing battlefield data in real time, China is leaving no stone unturned. The rise of sophisticated military robots and autonomous drones raises critical questions about the future of warfare, the ethics of using such technology, and the potential for unintended consequences. Are we entering an era where wars are fought and won by machines, with minimal human involvement? Let's go! Welcome to Revo. Now your go-to channel for all things revolutionary. At Revo Now, we are passionate about exploring the innovations, breakthroughs, and game-changing ideas that are shaping the world today. Our mission is to bring you the latest and most impactful advancements in technology, science, culture, business, and beyond, all in one place. Please subscribe, like, and share our videos. Turkey, a nation straddling Europe and Asia, has undergone a remarkable military transformation in recent years. The solution is not merely about acquiring shiny new toys. Facing conflicts on multiple fronts, Turkey has recognized the crucial role drones can play in projecting power, gathering intelligence, and conducting precision strikes with minimal collateral damage. This combination of technological innovation and battlefield experience has made Turkey a force to be reckoned with in the world of drone warfare. At the heart of Turkey's drone revolution lies the Bayraktar TB2, a medium-altitude, long-endurance, unmanned combat aerial vehicle that has become a symbol of Turkey's growing military prowess. Developed by Baykar Makina, a Turkish defense company, the TB2 has garnered international attention for its effectiveness in various conflicts. The TB2's ability to loiter over a target area for extended periods, providing real-time intelligence and delivering precision strikes with its laser-guided munitions, has proven invaluable in asymmetric warfare scenarios. The TB2's impact has been particularly notable in conflicts like the Nagorno-Karabakh war between Armenia and Azerbaijan. This success has not gone unnoticed with countries around the world taking note of the TB2's capabilities and Turkey's success in integrating drones into its military doctrine. While the Bayraktar TB2 has undoubtedly put Turkey on the map as a drone power, it's just the tip of the iceberg. Turkey has even more ambitious plans for the future. With a robust drone development program aimed at expanding its fleet and pushing the boundaries of unmanned aerial technology. One notable project is the Bayraktar Akinci a larger and more capable drone designed to complement the TB2. Beyond combat drones, Turkey is also focusing on developing drones for intelligence gathering, surveillance, and electronic warfare. The Turkish military envisions a future where drones of all shapes and sizes will work in concert, forming a networked and integrated aerial force multiplier. Now, let's shift our focus to the east, 
where another giant is stirring, China. China is pouring massive resources into research and development, aiming to not just catch up with, but to surpass the West in fields like artificial intelligence, robotics, and autonomous systems. This technological leap forward is deeply intertwined with China's geopolitical ambitions. As China's economic and military might grow, so too does its desire for a greater say in global affairs. China's advancements in military robotics are not just about bolstering their defences, they are part of a grander strategy to reshape the global balance of power. While much of the world's attention has been focused on China's growing fleet of warships and advanced fighter jets, a silent revolution is also underway within the People's Liberation Army, or PLA. The PLA is undergoing a high-tech transformation, incorporating cutting-edge robotics technology into its ground forces at an unprecedented rate. These aren't just your average remote-controlled toys, we're talking about sophisticated unmanned ground vehicles, or UGVs, designed for a variety of combat and support roles. These UGVs are equipped with an array of sensors, cameras and communication systems, allowing them to operate autonomously or under the control of human operators. The PLA sees these UGVs as force multipliers, enhancing the combat effectiveness of their troops while reducing casualties. But China's ambitions in military robotics go far beyond simply building bigger, better robots. They are at the forefront of a global race to develop artificial intelligence, or AI, for military applications. This means creating autonomous systems that can learn, adapt, and make decisions on the battlefield with minimal human intervention. Imagine a swarm of AI-controlled drones coordinating their attacks with pinpoint accuracy, adapting their tactics in real time based on the evolving battlefield situation. Picture AI systems analyzing vast amounts of intelligence data identifying patterns and providing commanders with actionable insights at lightning speed. China's pursuit of AI-powered warfare is driven by the potential to reduce casualties and operate at speeds and with a level of precision that surpasses human capabilities. Now, you might be wondering, how is the United States, the world's long-standing military superpower, reacting to this surge in drone and robotic technology from Turkey and China? While the US still maintains a technological edge in many areas, the rapid progress made by Turkey and China, particularly in the affordability and deployment of these systems, has definitely shaken things up. The rise of Turkey and China in the drone and robotics arena highlights a crucial shift in the landscape of military innovation. It's no longer just about having the most advanced technology. It's about developing and deploying it quickly, adapting to evolving threats, and producing these systems at scale and at a competitive cost. This strategy of quantity, coupled with rapidly improving quality, is putting pressure on the US to rethink its approach to drone warfare. The advancements we're witnessing in drone and robotic technology aren't merely shifting the balance of military power. They're ushering in a new era of strategic competition. This competition extends beyond traditional battlefields, spilling into the realms of cyberspace, space, and the very fabric of the global economy. In this new era of warfare, control of the skies is no longer enough. Dominance will be determined by who can master the domains of artificial intelligence, autonomous systems, and the seamless integration of these technologies into existing military doctrines. It's about who can gather and analyze information faster, make decisions and deploy countermeasures with greater speed and precision. Countries that can effectively foster innovation, attract top talent and build robust domestic industries will have a distinct advantage in this new global order. Now, while we've been focusing on the geopolitical and technological aspects of this drone and robotics revolution, we can't ignore the elephant in the room, the ethical implications. As we move towards increasingly autonomous weapon systems, we enter a moral minefield fraught with complex questions about accountability, human control, and the very nature of warfare itself. Imagine a battlefield where machines are making life-or-death decisions, potentially without human intervention. Think about the potential for unintended consequences for errors in judgment or malfunctions that could lead to civilian casualties or even unintended escalation of conflict. The development and deployment of autonomous weapons 
systems raise profound questions about human judgment, accountability, and the potential for unintended consequences. Fasten your seatbelts, everyone, because we're about to take a trip into the future of warfare. The advancements we've discussed, Turkey's drone revolution, China's robotic prowess, and the global race for AI dominance, are not isolated events. They are interconnected trends that are fundamentally reshaping the global security landscape. The battlefields of tomorrow will be unlike anything we've seen before, characterized by speed, complexity, and a blurring of the lines between the physical and digital realms. Imagine a battlefield where swarms of autonomous drones, both large and small, fill the skies, acting as the eyes and ears of ground forces, relaying real-time intelligence, and launching precision strikes with lightning speed. Meanwhile, unmanned ground vehicles, some resembling heavily armed tanks, others designed for stealth and reconnaissance, navigate the terrain with an agility and awareness that surpasses human capabilities. But it's not just about the hardware. The true game-changer will be the integration of artificial intelligence into every aspect of warfare. AI algorithms will analyse vast amounts of data from multiple sources – satellites, drones, sensors, even social media – to provide commanders with a comprehensive and constantly updating picture of the battlefield. AI will optimise logistics, predict enemy movements, and even assist in making split-second decisions in the heat of combat. One of the most significant developments we can expect to see in the near future is the rise of swarm warfare. Imagine hundreds, even thousands, of small, relatively inexpensive drones operating as a collective, coordinating their actions through sophisticated algorithms, overwhelming enemy defences through sheer numbers and adaptability. This concept once relegated to the realm of science fiction, is rapidly becoming a reality. The beauty of swarm technology lies in its decentralised nature. Each drone in the swarm acts as an independent node, capable of communicating with its neighbours and adapting to changing circumstances. The loss of a few drones has minimal impact on the swarm's overall effectiveness. This resilience, coupled with the ability to overwhelm defences through sheer numbers, makes swarm warfare a potent and potentially game-changing tactic. But the development of effective swarm technology presents significant technological hurdles. Creating algorithms that can enable hundreds or thousands of drones to operate autonomously, communicate effectively, and make collective decisions in real time is no easy feat. It requires breakthroughs in artificial intelligence, distributed computing, and communication systems. The rise of drone and robotic warfare, coupled with the increasing integration of artificial intelligence, presents profound challenges not just for the military, but for society as a whole. How do we prepare for a future where wars might be fought and won by machines? How do we ensure human control over these powerful technologies? And how do we navigate the ethical dilemmas posed by autonomous weapon systems? The answers to these questions are complex and multifaceted. They require a global dialogue involving policymakers, military leaders, ethicists, and technologists. We need to establish clear international norms and regulations governing the development and use of autonomous weapon systems, ensuring that human judgment remains at the heart of any decision to use lethal force. But it's not just about rules and regulations. We also need to foster a greater understanding of these technologies and their implications among the general public. This includes educating people about the potential benefits and risks of AI and robotics, promoting responsible innovation in these fields, and ensuring that the development of these technologies aligns with our values and serves humanity's best interests. As we've explored in this whirlwind tour of cutting-edge military tech, one thing is abundantly clear. We're on the cusp of a new era in warfare. The rise of combat drones and military robots, spearheaded by nations like Turkey and China, is fundamentally reshaping the global balance of power. The battlefields of tomorrow will be dominated by speed, precision, and an ever-increasing reliance on autonomous systems. But this technological revolution is not without its challenges. As we've discussed, the ethical implications of autonomous weapons systems the potential for unintended consequences and the need for international cooperation to regulate the development and use of these technologies are issues that demand our immediate attention. 
The future is being written right now, and it's up to us to ensure that it's a future where technology serves humanity, not the other way around. So that's it for today's deep dive, folks. I hope you found it informative, thought-provoking, and maybe even a little bit mind-blowing. As always, I'm eager to hear your thoughts. Drop your comments below, let me know what you think about the rise of drone and robot warfare, and don't forget to tell me what other mind-blowing topics you want me to cover in future videos. This is Revo Now, signing off, but always keeping an eye on the horizon. Stay curious, stay informed, and until next time, take care.